Hey guys, this is Ron Moore, and this is the inaugural low budget Let's Play here on YouTube. And I am joined by J Man 462 blah 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 something. I lost the combination. Uh, how's it going, J Man? Uh, it's going pretty good. That was pretty pretty close. Pretty good enough. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I could not get Bill Roddy to join us this week to play Battletoads, so J Man volunteered. And um, this is actually my first time playing this game, believe it or not. And I'm going to get flamed for that. But um, J-Man here is the master of Battletoads, so go ahead and give us eh, go ahead and give us a little synopsis on this game, J-Man. Okay, well this game is basically about a, a dark queen that kidnapped uh, one of the Battletoads and the, the queen of somewhere or other. And so uh, a falcon or a, a bird of some kind and two other toads have to go on the hardest mission ever to uh, save them. Yeah, and I, I've seen a lot of uh, videos on YouTube. Um, from Angry Video Game Nerd, uh, Bill O'Reilly, and other people playing this game, and this game does look impossible. Yes, uh, this this first stage is, is very easy, but after that it, it starts to get a little hard, and before you know it, it's almost impossible. Yeah, um, so have you beaten this game? Um, yeah, but there's one level that uh, I have a lot of trouble with in general, the, the, the Clinger Winger. Not to clean your wiener, but to clean your winger. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking to clean your what? Um, <laughs> now, uh, the reason why we are not playing two-player simultaneous action is because uh, this game is much harder with two-player simultaneous action. Much, much harder. As, Just uh, like... as the angry video game nerd and, uh, and uh, Kyle Justin showed us. Yeah. Previously. And, and yeah, uh, so this, this first stage, is, it's really not a big deal. The second stage gets a little harder, and then the third stage is where it starts. <laughs> this level right here reminds me of Turtles in Time, where uh, you throw the foot soldiers at Shredder. Yeah. It's, uh, I think I think that we could uh, uh, file a copyright claim, or uh, Battletoads <laughs> file a copyright claim against yeah. the Turtles. I always thought she was hot. I'm like, if I was the Battletoads, I would, I would side I'm with her. Queen. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I think that that's ha why she has so many minions uh, working for her. <laughs> yeah. The, the hotness factor. And I believe uh, two-player simultaneous action in this stage is real tough. Am I right? Uh, yes. Uh, you're you're uh, correctly correct with that assumption. Uh, <laughs> correctly correct. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes, sir, Bobsky. Um, ECW. <laughs> ECW. Uh, yeah, because you will end up hitting your partner more than you will hit the actual enemies, I found. Yeah, really, I've seen that in the Angry Video Game Nerds review. I was like, that's crazy, man. Yeah, it was almost like playing Street Fighter 2 or something against a buddy instead of <laughs> trying to team up, you know. Yeah, and uh, I know, like, Double Dragon Double Dragon 1 or 2, I think, Game B option, you can... Why would anybody want to pick that option? I mean, you don't want to hit each other. I, I want... think that... I don't know... It, Maybe they started that in other countries, and maybe other countries like to do stuff like that. Uh, Not here in the USA. USA. Yeah, we want things easy. Um, and, see, I mean, the music in this game is pretty cool. Yeah, it's, uh, that's definitely one of the things, besides the controls, I, mean, I know it's a hard game, but, but the controls are so smooth Yeah. that with enough practice, you'll only go uh, insane half the time that you play the game. Yeah. I've, I've had a couple controllers that have actually accidentally, you know, fell on the ground and not work, worked as well as they used to. Yeah. <laughs> so is this still the first stage or second stage? Uh, this is the second stage right here. Okay. This is still... It's... With a little bit of memorization, it's easy. Yeah. This stage right here reminds me of one of the stages in Donkey Kong Country 2 where you play as squawks and you gotta go into that honeybee pit or whatever. I have not played it. I've only played the first one. Ah, uh, okay. I'll um, check that out one of these days. So there's three characters in this game, is that right? And which character are you playing with now? Well, uh, that's that's Rash, I believe, and then the other one is Zitz, and uh, uh, Pimple is the is the one that got captured, and he's the big guy. I don't understand why the big guy got captured. You, shouldn't, mm -hmm. you should be able to play with the big guy. Yeah, really. But in the uh, there's a sequel. And then in that game, you're actually the big guy, the pimple guy. Ah, okay. So, so there's three of them then. Yeah, all together there's three. 
Yeah, I'm not too, too familiar with Battletoads. I'm mainly familiar with the Ninja Turtles. Yeah, um, for, for me personally, um, I really didn't even get into Battletoads until I, until I seen the, the AVGN review. Like, I, I played when I was a kid, and this stage that we're about to watch right now is the farthest that I ever got when I was a kid, and then I seen that review, and it, it reminded me, it was like, oh yeah, and, and so I went on a mission. And I was ah. like, I'm going to beat that stage. Is this the tunnel stage where yep. you go, where, where Bill Roddy failed at? Yep. Ah, oh, okay. And I remember, I remember this when I watched that review from a kid, and and I had to avenge uh, my my failures from from childhood. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. That was my motivation to play this game again. So is this game as hard as Delhi Towers? Oh yeah, uh, harder. Wow. Uh, what about Action Fifty Two? Um. Well, harder to play or. <laughs> <laughs> or harder, uh, or action 52 is harder to play than anything because you just, you don't want to play it. Harder to play as in hard to beat or as in hard to stomach. Hard to yeah, hard to turn on. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Deadly powers wins that. <laughs> yeah. Difficulty wise, this I, I think this is even harder than I want to be the guy just simply because okay, if you're playing on an emulator, you can save, but if you're playing on Nintendo, you can't. You, you can get three yeah. continues and it's over. So wait a minute, is this is this easy mode? Because this is not what Bill O'Reilly was doing. No, that that that'll be coming up. It's, this starts off it starts off easy. This part's really long. Oh, okay. So it starts off kind of easy, like right here. This is just the first gate. We're about to cross the second gate. Oh, okay. okay. Asking to speed up a little bit. Man, this would have drove me. This would have drove me crazy as a kid. Yeah, it'd drive you crazy as a adult, a senior. <laughs> A, uh, you know, when I was a kid, I had a temper when I couldn't beat levels. I remember getting very angry at this part as a kid. And I think everybody else that ever played this game. This yeah, really. A lot of people gave up. I mean, I played Battletoads for Game Boy. I'm not sure if there's more than one on Game Boy or what, but I played some sort of Battletoads, Battletoads game on the Game Boy. And, uh, that's really the only Battletoads game I've ever played. I've never uh, played this one, but I've always heard good things about it. Yeah, it's... Uh, just except for the difficulty of it, it's a really fun game to play. Just yeah. The controls are, are they're just, they're so responsive, and it's good now, music to listen to. Yeah. And it now, doesn't get boring because you're trying to get past the levels and stuff. Watch out for the barriers. Yes. Thank you, uh, for Skip. Speaking, for Skip, definitely. On <laughs> <laughs> um, now, this game is challenging. With, with that said, is it is it BS challenging or just... Uh, you know, challenge like challenging, challenging. It's challenging, challenging. There is there are a couple parts that are cheap. Yeah. But for the most part, it's just. Uh, <laughs> yeah. It's just. I mean, you you watch it and you're like, I can do that, and then you play it and you're like, Are you kidding me? Yeah, really. And I love Simon's Quest, but you know, there are some parts in that game where it's BS hard. Like, yes. how is are you supposed to know to kneel next to the wall and the tornado's gonna come? That's exactly what I was gonna say. There's the part. Oh yeah. Go, let's do it live. <laughs> we'll do it live. Freaking thing sucks. Yeah, the the, the trick that I learned, um, and I, I kind of when I first when I first beat that that part right there, I I used an emulator, so I was able to just save it right before that part. Yeah. And just try it, you know, a hundred times, and finally I figured it out. And you own that level. Yes, pure. That's ownage. pretty good. Uh, Bill O'Reilly's got to be ticked off. <laughs> Uh, Bill O'Reilly would get mad at this level as well. It's, uh, we'll do it live. We'll do it live. Uh, this level, it looks, it looks, it's easier than the last level, but it can see. Ah, oh, got me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you make this game look easy. You must really know this game like the back of your hand. You must have played this a lot uh, throughout your whole life. Uh, well, just after the the, the nerd video, I just oh, okay. started playing. I play. You know, two or three hours a day, and, and just really the, the big key is memorizing everything. Yeah. And after that, you just you let your hands play the game. Yeah. You get to Skip Rogers' hands. <laughs> yeah. You team to Skip Rogers' hands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about Master Hand and Crazy Hand? Um, those might work as well. Yeah. <laughs> he, I believe he said that he, could, he was very good at this game as well. I want to see the, the tag team match between those four. <laughs> Well, I'm sure that they would have better skills than dying right there like I just did. Yeah. (laughs) 
Besides uh, the platforms, you got these snow snowmen throwing these snowballs at you that can whack you in the face and damn near kill you. Yeah. And uh, you also got those uh, big snowball, uh, like the hostess cupcake snowball looking things, pink things. Hey, yeah, really. I hate those things, and I hate those. I, I would probably hate those things in this game too. Yeah, it's it's like as far as challenge, you hate them, and then you remember eating one as a kid and hate them in that way too. Yeah. So that, I think they could. That, I think that makes them even harder to avoid in the game. Yeah. You know to. to because you're like, oh god, I gotta stay away from that, and, and it tricks you up, and you die. Yeah. What are those spike turtle shells right there? Uh, yeah, they're uh, they're uh, another another copy of the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah. Which I think Battletoads is based off the turtles, anyways. Yeah, really. I always thought that, that they ripped off the turtles. 